Sudan fighting. Chinese evacuees fly home via Eritrea. The Chinese government has started evacuating its citizens from Sudan where a vicious power struggle between the regular army and a powerful paramilitary force has led to violence across Sudan for more than a week. The first batch of these 35 Chinese evacuees departed for China on Thursday after arriving in Asmara, the capital city of Eritrea, by land. A growing list of countries have evacuated diplomats and citizens from Sudan's capital by air while some have gone via Port Sudan on the Red Sea, about 800 kilometers, 500 miles, by road from Khartoum. The Chinese embassy in Asmara indicated that some Chinese citizens in Sudan have been safely and smoothly evacuated via Eritrea back to China. According to the Chinese Foreign Ministry, between Tuesday and Thursday, Nearly 800 people have been transferred by sea and more than 300 have traveled to neighboring countries of Sudan by land. There have been no casualty reports so far, the ministry said. China has a significant presence in Sudan, with many Chinese companies investing in the country's oil industry and infrastructure projects. As such, the safety of Chinese nationals in Sudan is a top priority for the Chinese government.